Well, absolutely, Aisha, in any moment now, we are expecting the Prime Minister to arrive here at the Parliament Hill Airport. And in fact, uh, in the morning, first, uh, coming directly from the Hazel Tour of uh, South Africa and Greece, he landed in Big Blue. And in fact, he also addressed them, and now, here also in the national capital, he is expected to arrive at any time soon. We are expecting him to reach here by around 11, 20 is what they are given to understand. In fact, this place uh, is decked up to welcome Prime Minister Narendra Modi. I will first take you the visuals from this very place, how the supporters of the Bharti Janta Party and in fact Prime Minister are here, gathered in huge numbers over here to welcome the Prime Minister, who in fact the first visited, in fact, the British nations and party attended the very summit and in fact then he visited Greece and in fact, now he's returning home. He has, he has in fact returned home as they first he addressed and met with the scientist of uh, Isro and now. Of, uh, Isro and now in the national capital is returning. And in fact, uh, here also, this entire stage is being set where we expect that Prime Minister will be actually speaking to the people here in the national capital and across the country. Um, uh, this entire place is decked up. In fact, the senior leaders of the Bharti Janta Party are also here, including, in fact, the MPs are here. Um, uh, and the, uh, the Delhi BJP president, Virendra Sajdewa, is here. Bhaijan Panda, all the senior leaders of the party are here to actually welcome Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Because this time around, it is not just about one thing. There are many things which the country is celebrating. In fact, uh, uh, first, uh, the successful landing of Chandrayaan and, in fact, uh, then um, the entire um, the Prime Minister's visit to, um, to different parts of the world where he attended this meeting and in fact also uh, where he met the head of the state in Greece. So this is a very positive occasion for the country as well because right now G20 is also around the corner when we are seeing uh, heavy preparations in the national capital and in fact here you can see how the workers are also very much related with Prime Minister uh, to the nation and in fact returning back to Delhi as of now we'll try and get in a word from some of the workers. Aap aaj kitne excited hai aur kitna intazar kar rahe Pradhan Mantri ka Delhi aane ke? Aam subay chhe baje aise yaan pe aaye hoi hai aur bhoot hi har sa rullas ke saath unka intazar kar rahe hai. Hame aisa jase shakshat pra burram ke darshan honge. क्या मैसेज रहेगा प्रधानमंत्री जी के लिए अभी वो इतना टूर करके आ रहे हैं चंद्रयान की सक्सेस है आगे आने वाले समय में जी ट्वेंटी होने वाला है क्या एक संदेश देना चाहेंगे उनके लिए मैसेज है दो हजार चौबीस में भी भारत की जनता उनको दोबारा से प्रधानमंत्री ती, तीसरी बार प्रधानमंत्री देखना चाहती है मोदी जी को जय श्री राम सो आयशा दिस इज दर्ड कमिंग इन फ्रॉम द बीजेपी वर्कर्स प्रेजेंट ओवर हेयर एंड इन फैक्ट दिस इज वॉट दे आर से Uh, that uh, uh, they are related with the Prime Minister coming back to the national capital and in fact the message which Prime Minister gave in the morning and in fact the uh, uh, the speech he gave in the morning was an uh, uh, emotional one where he mentioned about uh, how it was a continuous effort which made possible uh, uh, is to the Chandrayaan success was uh, possible because of this entire continuous effort which were made by the scientists of the country and in fact he also talked about how this is a game changer not only for India but uh, this is for the entire world in fact we know that India becomes the very first nation to actually land on the southern side of the moon which is considered to be the dark side and in fact now if you go by the scientific and the technicalities in this matter uh, the rover landing on the moon and in fact the rover starting to collect data this will be a big uh, turning point uh, in terms of uh, scientific uh, research in the country and across the world because no one was able to achieve this very feat which now India has achieved and in fact Prime Minister coming directly from uh, that uh, uh, entire tour from South Africa. Africa and Greece and directly land, landing in Bengaluru and in fact beforehand giving that very message that yes he was actually um, he was waiting for uh, to be with the scientist who made this entire journey possible. Now uh, this place is also uh, decked up as I told you um, in some moment from now Prime Minister will be coming there are Nagaras playing at the top of the voice people dancing over here in fact they say that this is 
not just about uh, this is not just about prime minister returning back but this is also about how um, uh, this entire um, uh, chandrayaan uh, success has been given to the nation and in fact how the prime minister is uh, um, part of this entire uh, success so right now uh, the wait is finally on and in fact uh, the preparations are also done over here entire palam uh, uh, airport technical airport is decked up and in fact in some moments from now we expect that the prime minister will be arriving here and in fact will be addressing the people once again from this very place back absolutely to you. and that's going to be pretty exciting to, exciting to witness could you also let us know but what is on the posters what's being said on the posters and what are the slogans that are also being raised Well, Aisha, the slogans are uh, that uh, uh, they are welcoming Prime Minister Modi, as I told you, and in fact, uh, you can see the posters also um, uh, largely read about the success of uh, Chandrayaan. In fact, uh, how uh, Chandrayaan was a big success for this very government and for the entire country, because uh, this is not a work which was actually done in just a couple of days. This is a uh, this is something which was done. Uh, uh, this was a hard work of the scientists, which paid. Now, when India lands on the moon on the southern side of the moon in fact uh, a lot of attempts were also made by people uh, by different countries earlier but uh, nobody was actually successful quite successful to actually reach to that very point where india um, has managed to reach and um, this is the point which the workers are also raising that the kind of speech prime minister has given in bengaluru shows one thing that uh, how pm's commitment uh, to uh, this uh, uh, commitment to actually be indulged in each and every feat of the country uh, which is being achieved by the nation by uh, by india and this is the message and in fact these are the billboards which uh, continuously reads that uh, how uh, this is a big success for the country and in fact uh, how this is not only success uh, of the government but it is it is a collaborated effort, uh, effort of the scientists and the government which actually um, uh, resulted in uh, this very huge success back to you absolutely yash i'm going to request that you stay with us we're going to listen in to the prime minister lauding isro scientists india is on the moon we have our national pride placed on the moon hum wahan pahunche jahan koi nahi pahuncha tha jis sthan par chandrayaan 3 ka moon lander utra hai अब उस पॉइंट को अब उस पॉइंट को शिव शक्ति के नाम से जाना जाएगा 23 अगस्त को जब भारत ने चंद्रमा पर तिरंगा फहराया उस दिन को अब हिंदुस्तान नेशनल स्पेस डे के रूप में मनाया जाएगा Now with that we're going to be crossing back over to CNN News 18's Yash Goyal who again joins us joins us from Palam Airport where the prime minister is expected to arrive in a very short while from now. Remember he's already returned from India this morning and essentially that bite that you just listened into that was the prime minister speaking at the ISRO command center lauding the ISRO scientists for the big achievement of India finally being on the moon. Now we are crossing back over to CNN News 18's Yash Goyal as mentioned. Uh Yash you've been able to give us a lot of details about what's going to be expected with the prime minister is going to be is is going to be making an address can we also expect a road show like the one that we saw in bengaluru a short while ago tamam aap dekh sakte hain aur tamam kaam karta hai well aisha it's very hard to tell as of now but the plan as of now is prime minister will be landing in some time from now here in the national capital and uh, uh, then what we expect is prime minister to come from this very road and in fact when he comes from this road and fact then he will be going to that podium which is the stage which is set over there and in fact then he will be addressing uh, this entire gathering over here and not uh, this speech will not only for this gathering but in fact for the people of the country because right now 
India is witnessing one of the greatest achievements in the space history. Um, and in fact, right now, Prime Minister's also, uh, Prime Minister Address in Bengaluru also mentioned that very one fact. And in fact, the gesture of Prime Minister hugging S. Somnath, uh, Isro Chief, also gives out a very message that how Prime Minister himself is elated with this very feat of Isro. The workers are here, are very excited. We'll once again go to them and in fact try.